Good afternoon, everyone. I'm back, Lucha FM, for another episode of the uh, Dynamo Tulibisi and Georgian national team save. Um, nice to see Georgia beating Portugal last night. Uh, good result for them. Fair play to them. They're through to the next round. Um, they were definitely the underdogs in that group, but they've done really well. Cavadona scored as well, so good to see. Um, but yeah, look, where, where you left us off last? Um, we're currently six in the league after five games played, 19 points. We're not doing as well as we should be. Um, we should be towards the top, so we need to do something about that. But um, if you look at the last six games, no, seven games, no, sorry, six, I apologise, I can't count today. The last six games were unbeaten, we've won three and drawn three. So hopefully that means we can turn things around. Um, but yeah. Just a little short intro, I'm wearing my new authentic uh, into Miami shirt, it's a fake one by the way, but it's a really good one, so yeah, um, but anyway, right, I'll be back in a minute with the first part of the episode. Right, so here we are, play our first game, playing Dynamo Kagumi, like I said, this is a whole new country for me so I don't know any of the team. Um Gordy's in the team as well as um I of the I of I have Billy. Uh but we like to call him the Rudy here. It's a lot easier. <coughs> Again, I apologise for my really croaky voice. I've only just when I record these it's first thing in the morning, it's currently six o'clock in the morning. So my voice is not the most nicest sounding at the moment. So yeah. Maybe I need to do some, some vocal exercises before I uh, start recording. Just been so, oh yeah, first highlight. We are in the blue, they are in the white. Oh. Hopefully I can replicate George's national team uh, in real life. And get through to the next round of the Euros, but we'll see. Bit of passing here. Yeah. High end Jock, first goal of the game, 1 0 to us. I think since I've changed this uh, tactic, it's worked quite well. See, we're now up to third. Hideke in the corner. One nil, twenty minutes played. One to us, the deputy with the corner. Ah. Hey, hello. That's the smells very nice. We just had a bath in the bed, so it smells like a shampoo. It smells very sweet. Can you see it? Smells very sweet. Say hello, back to us. Dooley's injured. Right. Are they going to get an equalizer before half time? Yes, they are. I swear that was offside, but okay. Uh, for anybody who doesn't know, the Steam, Steam Summer Sale is on. Um, and I'll come back from my walk later and have a good look on there, see if I can find any games to play. I've got there, I've ordered a Steam Deck handheld games console, for people who don't know. Um, Steam Deck is basically a handheld console, very good. Um, handheld console, very powerful. And um, the good thing about it is you can play your games that you already have installed on your computer, on your Steam library, it's on there. So you don't even need, I think I've got this right, you don't even need to download them on your handheld, they'll already be on your, in your library as soon as you log in. Could be wrong, but I think that's true. Um, but yeah, so that's coming at some point this week, or maybe the start of next week. Yeah, I'll be looking forward to having a little play with that. I'm, I'm, I'm going to buy um, Dave the Diver later and 
grow taco and um car wash uh what it's called car wash since then i can't remember what it's called now but yeah just little games like that that i can wait i can waste a bit of time on on the night when i'm a bit bored oh go on ah nearly um by the way i did another fake shirt video yesterday uploaded it so feel free to have a look it's a little bit long but it is pretty it is pretty in-depth in in the shirts so it'll give you a clear indication of how good these fake shirts are um and like i said it'll also let you know like you know i'll leave i'll let you know which place i got it from as well so you can then buy me some if you want uh not the best for big people like me but if you're not if you're not a big person then they're, they're very good um and i'll save you so much money because legit authentic football shirts are so so expensive these days that's why i go down the mystery shirt route because if i cost about 35 quid to get a football shirt I'm not particularly bothered what team it is or anything like that um some are really good some have been really rubbish but Oh, lovely little half holly there by Santa. But at the end of the day, overall, I would say I'm probably very satisfied with the shirts I've had so far from the uh, from the mystery boxes that I've got, and I'm going to order some more next week as well. So I'll do a couple of reviews for them. You never know; I might get a Dynamo Villa Vissi T-shirt, a uh, uh, football shirt, sorry, at some point from one of these mystery boxes. That'd be good. At some point I'll probably get an international shirt because when the Euros finish a lot of the football national team football shirts will be cheap. So uh you never know. Ooh. Right, let's keep this lead. Can't take more players off because we've got to get on with it. Gordy. I've started a offline save on Football Manager um, with Oxford United, who, because I've got the latest data updates um, from Pro One, and uh, Oxford are in the Championship, so it was very, very, very difficult. The first season, not only just managed to stay up, um, but the second season doing really well. I signed, uh, I've signed my main man Deli Ali for him, and he's doing really well. So. Um, yeah, I'm like, I think I'm second or third in the championship after about 10 games played. I'm not going to get too excited because obviously there's still a lot of the season to go. How long is Jadouli in his water? Oh, no, 79 weeks. Such an important player for us as well. Right then, you know the score. I'll be back in a second with the next game. All right, we're back. Um, we're now playing a team called San Heredia. Um, sounds like a... Italian lemonade brand, doesn't it? Um, anyway, let's see how we get on. We've got no Jaduli. Uh, Aiden Jock is injured for a week as well, so he's not in this game. Uh, nice to have Julia back there. Got this player up front. I don't think he's played much yet. He's going to make a couple of club appearances, so let's see how good he is. We are in the white with the blue shorts. First highlight of the game. Might be going to us by the looks of it. Building up slowly from the defence. Simon gives it to Paco Sadzi. Gives it to Dogna and Mizu. There you go. Levan Oscar Osik Osik Mashvili. Osik Mashvili. Or as we like to call him, Ozzy. It's easier for me to say. Ozzy with the first game, uh, Ozzy with the first goal of the game. Get another one, let's extend the lead. A few, uh, oh, nearly. A few 4 4 2 tactics I'm using seems to work it through with these players. Which is good. Oh, 
not many fans in the stand for this game, but it looks a bit. Oh, they've got Sunday. I wonder if he's any good. <clears throat> Good tackle. Right. In the sky. Four caps for Nigeria, one goal. Uh, not the most terrific goal scorer it be. But maybe he's just never had the right manager. Maybe if he plays for me, he'll start to do well and score more goals. You never know. Oh, nearly. Arunana, the ball. <clears throat> Julia, lovely ball. Oh, okay. <coughs> I feel like I swallowed about 20 spiders again. Does this happen to everybody else? Um, let me know in the comment section. When you get up in the morning, does it sound like you swallowed about 20 spiders? Is it just a normal thing? I think I only noticed it when I started recording videos because. As you can imagine, when I get up first thing in the morning, I'm not really going to be doing much talking. Um, so I don't know whether it's something that it's all for. Oh, so sorry. I'm not the best when it comes to uh, doing editing and stuff like that. So you, you see everything, unfortunately. Yeah, winning 2 0. Nice, great, great performance so far by the lads. Any player that's playing poorly is um, Aku Sati, unfortunately. So I might take him off in a bit for his own sake. Hopefully, I can sign Deli Ali for this team, but I don't think he'll come to us. But I can dream, can I? Oh, what a ball. Go on, sign him. <laughs> Go on, get in. 3 0. We are fucking on gas now, everybody. <clears throat> He was going to intercept it. They look nervous with the ball here. They look like they're going to lose it in a second. Yeah, here we go. No, no, maybe not. Good, intercept. good interception there. Good vision by Haruna to pick up that pass. To intercept the pass. Not pick up the pass. Sorry. <clears throat> I feel like this is going to be a goal for them coming up. Three one, we're still winning, still doing well. I'm gonna take off um Aku Santi though. Put on a player called Dox Doxy Ridsty Ridsy. Uh not much is happening now. Oh, here we go. Let's get another goal. Good ball, go on. Oh, what a debut for Dabit. I'm going to call him Dabit. It's easy to say. Go on, Dabit. Let's have it for Dabit. There you go. I think with these players, it's a lot easier just to call them by their first name. You know, I'm a, I'm a type of coach that likes to do that. I like to call everybody their first name, not by their surname. So, like, you know, disrespecting them. I'm going to call them by their first name. Right, we'll just see this game out now. They might get a, another consolation goal here, but we're not bothered. We know we're going to win the game. Big header is out. Right, three kicks lined up. We get another one before the end of the game. Romanowski. 
on of course, good save for the goalie. No, no need for the corner. Lovely little win. So this episode is going so far very well. Two wins in two games in this episode. Very good. Uh, what I'll do is pick up holiday and then I'll be back in a second with the next part of the episode. Right, so now we're playing um Sa Sabatalo Sabatalo again. Sounds Italian to me. Um we've got Okasati and Sotarigi Sotarigi up front. Um so we're quite weak up front. I think most of our main strikers are out. So we've just got to make do with this. Um I did off track first. I think that's pretty much it. There's no other shots I can see here in the lineup. So we'll just get on with the game. Hopefully the more time the more time Taku Sadzi gets with it, hopefully he'll get better. Because his potential is pretty good if you look at him. Let's just have a look at this. If you look at him, he's three to four star potential. At the moment he's two stars ability. Um but he's only suited he's only one star suited in this particular role. So maybe that's it. Maybe after we need to bring some recruits. Um need to target forward. I know we'll leave it. We won't we won't mess around with it just yet. Right, no highlights so far. Very quiet game. We've had zero shots, they've had one shot. Luckily, only other four shots on the target. Try and cruise in my players. I think this is what happens when you get two inexperienced strikers up front. They don't have the confidence to take a shot. All right, three shots now. None on target, though. We're in the blue, they're in the yellow. They've just spent what yellow? I mean, white, white with red stripes. One nil to them. Just before half time, which is not ideal. We've taken off straight away. Maybe this will lead to an equaliser before half time. Good ball by Sanchez. Get in. Got to Rizzi. Take it back into a game. Um, yeah, one more. Next highlights go into the opposition, though. Still no net. Good hair out. That's it. Go on, Isaac. Now we're going to break from the counter attack. Oh, yes. Go on. Nearly. Nearly, nearly, nearly. Uh, apparently, Koku Sadzi's got 7.5. He's doing better than the goal scorer, so I think he's probably got the assist. Maybe. I don't know. Firing up the players. See if that does anything. Oh, no, it might have had the reverse effect. Good defensive play there. Oh, that pass was over, so they don't need to worry about it. <coughs> right, um, not good enough. Where can we go? Two one. Um, if you're a big wrestling fan, by the way, and you love wrestling nostalgia, I highly recommend watching the um who killed WCW documentary series. I think it's four it's four parts, and they're they're really good. So I know I recommended it in another video I've done recently, but. Um, I just watched the last part yesterday and it's really, like I said, it's really good. If you're a big fan of 90s wrestling like I was growing up as a kid, then it definitely is the one for you. Alright, let's see if we can get a, a late equaliser here. Good, 
boxing going on here. Yes, get in. Go on, David. David with his second goal of the game. 2-2. Two, two. I do think we should have won this game, though. At least we didn't lose. We're still unbeaten in. I think we've had our three, you know. Uh, so we haven't lost the games since in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We haven't lost game in nine games since. So we're doing pretty good. I wouldn't say myself. Now, we are playing in eight days' time. So I'll be back in a second. Right, so now we've got um, Tel Aviv in the next game. We've got Gordy back. Um, so we've got uh, Faku Sabzi is back on the bench. I don't think he's ready for first team football just yet, but he's the experience will help him in the long run. Um, and I think that's it pretty much. We'll just get on with it now and see how we get on. so far very boring game it's gonna liven up a bit now though uh we're in the blue today by the way they're in the white sanchez with the ball bombing it down the wing using his pace oh that the nearly own goal there they've got the ball now can we press them or get the ball off them uh it looks like no oh no got it off them well done Deffy, the defensive play there. Gives it to Sanchez now. Again, Sanchez using his pace. Um, I think he's way too quick for this league. He's still up there. Gordy. Beautiful ball for Ramadas, who's nearly scored. Roman Ovski. Yeah, Roman Ovski. Not Roman Ovski. Roman Ovski. Right, Gordy. We are dominating them so far but we're not scoring which is a bit worrying Romanovsky gives it to Dobrovsky Dobrovsky there you go Romanovsky I think that was just a little there you go I knew it was offside Rising job. Lose the ball though. And um, opposition is now going to score. There you go. Hey. When you don't take the chances, this is what happens. 1 0 down, but we are going to get back in this game before half time, I've got a feeling. Nice free kick. Easy header for the goalkeeper to save. Have it back. Kadefe. Gives it Eisen Job. Got one, two passing transitions here. Keeping possession. Gordy. Uh, Dolinacci. Beautiful cross. Deserved the goal. That definitely deserved the goal. Very unlucky there to hit the bar. Still 1 0, even though we've been the better team. These things happen in football sometimes. That buzzing noise you can hear is a very annoying fly that I want to kill. Oh my god, we need to score the game then. I'm being FM there, everybody. Right, okay. Try encouraging. Let's try and be a bit gentler with them. <clears throat> Go 
Japan developed a team 9 shots, 3 on target, sorry, 10 shots, 3 on target, 1.56 XG. We definitely deserve a goal. Hit the post, I think the bar was low. We were very unlucky. Nice bit of passing going on there. On the throw in. Oh, what a goal by Sanchez. That was a great volley. He doesn't score a rubbish goal, Sanchez. I've noticed that. On one. Excellent. Pepe is the key there coming off. Yeah. We're quite lucky that we've got two very good left backs between Gadefi and Haruna. <clears throat> right, I think that's all I've asked to see. Good over the top ball there. Get in. Go on, damn it. It's becoming a right little goal scorer now, isn't he? I don't know what I don't know what's going on with that celebration there. That was a bit rubbish, wasn't it? <clears throat> Needs to work on his swagger. Right, Sanchez for four. What can he do? That's four. Sanchez, you just scored a wonder goal, and you're going to do this. Look, look how off, off the top we were lucky then. We were so lucky. I think Sanchez is knackered now. I think he's used up all his energy to get that goal. Now he's made a mistake. Hopefully one of these mistakes won't lead to us conceding. <coughs> right, can we get a late goal? Oh, that was a beautiful ball again. Go on, Gaffey. Ooh, nearly got his hand up there. Oh, no, not hand up. That's a goal. Good result, good result. We're starting to see some different players stand out as well, like Sanchez and uh, David. Um, still fourth though. We're like, there's literally like one point behind us in second place. I, I don't think we're going to win the title this year though, by the looks of it. <clears throat> um, right, and I'll be back for the Georgia versus Wales game in a second. Alright, we're back. There's definitely, definitely a bug on this game because um, I forgot, I completely forgot to do the squad selection for George National Team and they haven't picked Abadonna again. I don't know why. Um, let's just see if he's injured. He might be injured, but I don't think he is. It might be Napoli fifth because I haven't got the. Uh, I need to type in Italy first. This is the only thing about this because basically. I installed it on my new laptop and I forgot to install the uh, download the real name picture. So I need to do it this way and then I never remember what they're called. Oh my god, I never remember what they're called. That's it. Uh half an okay. Why are you? I don't understand why he's not available. I don't know why he's not getting picked, sorry. It's our highest rated that player. So I might have to sit um sack my assistant manager. But obviously it's him that's picking the team, I think. Picking the squad, sorry, to if it's left to the AI. So maybe it's something to do with that. I don't know. It's it's just really weird. Anyway, we have to get on with it for now. Um, but yeah, it just I don't understand why it, it does that. I don't, I don't know. You, it'd be like man, it'd be like um, England not picking Jude Bellingham for some reason, or Harry Kane, or whatever. It just it just wouldn't happen. And he is our best player, and he's not playing any international football. It's just like I said, really weird. He's going to retire uh, from international football at this rate if we don't. Maybe it's a book that needs to be um the side game Sega need to know about. Oh god, they got a lot they got a long throw specialist in the team here. That was a bit of a dodgy pass to the goalkeeper that could have passed by on it. At the moment it looks like it's gonna be all all Wales, but we'll see. 
what would have happened if we had Cavadonna in the team, I don't know. The only thing I can think of is the AI doesn't fit him because he's too young, maybe. I don't know. Well, he isn't, is he? He's 22, so I don't understand. Oh, good little goal. There is me. Oh, no, it's not that one. Um, see what VAR said. One nil against the Welsh. Get in. I was thinking Wales were the better team, but we are actually being the better team even before that goal. We were better than them on the start. I feel like Georgia, in a way, are very similar to um, Czech Republic and Croatia in like Euro '96 type of thing, where they just come into it and then they become established international teams and tournaments. Uh, I think Georgia will get there as well. I think they'll be in the tournaments most of the time as well because they are a very good side. And then obviously they've got Cavadonna and their goalkeeper as well as really highly rated. Um, I don't know what our player was doing then. I think he was trying to get the, that Welsh player sent off but that fired on him. We're doing well. If we get another goal, we'll probably win this. Oh yes, get in, go on. Uh maybe we don't need Cavadonna. Two nil. We are destroying the Welsh. I say that and I'll probably jinx us now and it'll probably be two two it'll probably end two two. Oh no, here we go. Oh, why did I open my mouth? Oh, why did I open my mouth? Oh, VAR might come to our rescue. Ah, yes, get in. Ah. I'm laughing like it's game over when we've won this game. It's still second half to go yet. If we get another one, though, we definitely win this game. I'll say that. Um, right. Good ball. Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the type of finish I used to do when I used to play football. Maybe I'm good enough to play for the Georgian national team at this rate, though. I'm only joking, by the way. Any, any Georgians watching? It'd be nice to actually have people from Georgia watching this. Um, if you're from Georgia and you're watching, and you're watching this series, uh, please let me know in the comment section. It would be nice. Any if you're a, if you're a Dynamo Chilavisi fan as well, please let me know in the comment section. And also, if anybody knows where I can get a Dynamo Chilavisi home shirt uh, or Excel, please let me know. And I am struggling to find one cheap. Um, there's there's ones on there's one or two on eBay, but they're like two hundred quid. I don't think it's, it's simply because it's a it's a rare shirt. I don't know why, but it's just it's just overpriced. Like most football shirts on eBay. Oh no. Oof. Luck is on our side in this game so far. Right, free kick to us. Ooh. That would have been game over if we scored that one there. I thought that was just him hitting it wide, but the goalkeeper got a hand on it, probably. Oh, no. Straight in the goalkeeper's hand. As the time is ticking, the game looks like it's going to be ours more and more. Good interception there. It was a terrible pass, though. He did the hard part easily, and the easy part hard. Right, come on, Baco. Let's get another goal. Let's kill these Welsh buggers off. Potting's been so hard today. Straight in the goalkeeper's hands. We need to. We need to make it harder for him, not easier. Playing it out from the back now. Offside. That's 
totally be offside. I'll be amazed if that's not offside. I'll be really annoyed if that's not offside. Sensi referee. <laughs> Unlucky you both others. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to call you what I used to call you as, as a kid. Because I used to, I assume it will be offensive now to call you uh, something that likes to have uh, fun with a certain farm animal. We'll, we'll leave it as that. Um, right back out. Oh yes, what a goal! That was a great goal. That was. Right, game over now. The dragons have been slayed. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I didn't want to do that. How do I cancel that? Oh, there you go. Lovely little win. I also played well as well. They've been unlucky to get two goals disallowed. Um, yeah, we've done really well to win this game. Floating over to switching it across to the right. Unfortunately, that interception. Right. Will Wales get a consolation goal or will we get to keep the clean sheet? He's such a good goalkeeper. Um, Mamadaki. What's his name? Mamadar. Mamad. Mamad. No. Mamad. Mamar Dash Lily. Mamar Dash Lily. Probably a quicker way to say that, but yeah. Mamar Dash Lily. Oh, nearly, nearly, nearly caught the goalkeeper off when he was uh, on the ball there. I think, fingers crossed, we're going to keep the clean sheet as well. It'll be a great performance overall for us. Might get another one here. We don't know what to do with the ball as soon as we get it off. Oh. They were very nervous when they had that ball. If that a constant player would have gone on and scored that. Right, let's see this game up now. Ah, oh, no, he's actually going to get the consolation. Oh, good ball. Yeah, oh well. It is what it is. Hope to God they don't get another one. I'm going to be really nervous for the last minute of that game. Good result, bad problem. I know I did that wrong, but it is what it is. Not too bothered. Right, when's next game? We play another play a game in three days. So what I'm going to do is just holiday. I won't bother um, coming off the. I won't bother ending the part of the video there. I'll just leave it like this because it really doesn't take that long to forward three days with this super quick laptop. There we go. I'm good to go. New George Star. Uh, Damit uh, Lavori. We are the obvious favourite to beat Malta. So now I've said that, you want to avoid lose. That was a very pointless meeting to have when there was nothing for me to do. Right, I'm going to rotate this team. I'm going to try out some new players. Because I feel like we're going to win. So we don't need to play our best players. Be nice to give some of the other players a bit of a chance. I don't even think it's it's changed much of it, but yeah, 
we'll see. I'll say this though, that more stuff you've got for them on target, maybe this was a mistake. Maybe we shouldn't have put them for granted. I think second yellow cards in charge of the multinational team, he's probably got about 20 Brazilians in there. Oh, nearly. Yeah, second yellow cards doing a really good um, job with the build a nation in Malta. Uh, so it's a long term series. So if you like to bunker down and watch some FM content, then he's definitely one for you. He also streams on Twitch as well. Um, he's seems like a really nice bloke. Um, helped he helped me recently when I was thinking of doing a build a nation uh, in Georgia. He was quite helpful with information and stuff like that. Of course they've got a bloody Colombian in their team. Shenanigans. That would be this would be hilarious if we beat um if we win three one against Wales and then lose to Malta. But yeah, he is yeah, he's playing for Fresh anyway. He's playing for Malta. Who else is he available to play for? French. So maybe he knew he probably wasn't ever gonna play for national team but fair play to Malta getting him to agree to play for us. I wonder if uh I know work my name work um work uh, work space what am on about um second year card I wonder if I, I was gonna say I wonder if he tried to get him to play for the Malta national team but I completely forgot he's not the Malta national team manager and I just never saw his name we have completely underestimated Malta here And again, we have been the better team stats wise, so we might we might get it, but as long as we don't lose, I'm not bothered. If we get a draw, we get a draw, lesson learned. If we can't lose, we've got a good ball. That header should have been better. to us. Oh, nearly got the equalizer there. We use the four of our subs. Yeah, we have. Right, we just gotta hope hope we can catch them on the break here. We are knocking on the door. Oh my god, look at the bloody goal. Um, this is quite concerning. Right, just trying to encourage them, that might help. I feel like we are going to get a goal. I feel like it's a matter of when, not if. Oh, we did the far again. It's twice now, was it twice? I feel like the longer this game goes, the less enthusiastic I am about us getting a point out of this. Come on, come on, come on. Need to do something here. Uh, there isn't much we can do, I don't think so. I thought I'd push midfielders a little bit, but we're already in there. Oh no. He's a good player for Malta, Tuma. Right, come on, let's get let's get this equalizer now. Let's catch them on the break. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, Cavilia. Loses the ball but gives it to it comes to uh Cavilietta. Paco. We got full score but the goal will be disallowed for VAR from VAR. Oh, get me, come on. VAR can shove that up their arse. Thank God for that. Right, can we get a get a, a late winner now? Where I've just popped out my shoulder doing that celebration. Um, true story, Sammy Zane did that once. We went, before he had a match with John Cena, he uh, he did his usual throwing the arm over and uh, you know, psyched up the crowd and he blew out his shoulder. I thought that he was out for like six months, if not longer. But yeah, don't don't get too excited when you celebrate, kids. 
Um, but yeah, we drew in the end, thank God. Wales not doing very well in this tournament. Austria doing well. We've basically in some spots. We've got a game ahead of Romania. So hopefully we can, we can win that game. Right then, on that note, I'm going to call it a day for this episode. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you had a nice time watching this. And thank you for your support as always. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, uh, leave a comment, like the video, it's all appreciated. The more people that like the video and subscribe and comment, the more that YouTube push it out and then more people watch. And it just does me a massive favour, so I really would appreciate it if you did. Um, try and watch the videos till the end. Try not to watch the first minute and then get bored. Um, try and persevere with it. I know probably my intros aren't the most exciting, but as we get into the game, Hopefully you'll like it. So just give it a bit of a chance. Um, I would appreciate it. But anyway, I'll be back tomorrow with another episode. All the best. Bye.